Good morning, St. Luke's. It is July 25th. We're sheltering in place. We're sheltering in God. I've been looking at prayer this week, and I think perhaps the most difficult prayer that Jesus taught us is pray for your enemies. Pray for those who persecute you. Now, you might not have an enemy, but you might have someone who irritates you or someone who makes you angry or someone who has hurt you or is hurting you. You might even have someone who has hurt you in the past and they're dead today. And yet you're still left with all of this pain. It's not an easy thing to pray for someone who hurts you, someone who has persecuted you, and yet this is the call. Now, for someone who's dead, I don't really think we need to pray for those who are dead. God takes care of the dead. But I think we can still pray for God to come and help us with the memories that we might be set free. I think that's a healing prayer that is very important that we're set free from anything in the past that would pull us down today. And for those of us who have people who are alive and well and hurting us, there's the call. Pray for your enemies. Pray for those who persecute you. Not an easy prayer, right? Not for the faint of heart, but certainly something that Jesus teaches. Peace be with you.